Welcome to Soul Horoscope Zodiac Weather. My name is Christopher Watecki, and I'm your stand-up astrologer. Well, it's Friday, Friday, October 16, 2009. The sun's progressed to 23 degrees, and this weekend, the moon is in Libra. Let's take a look at those planets. Well, if you're new to Soul Garden, I'm going to explain. It is light cast day this weekend. In fact, this whole weekend is the light casting period. The light casting period is the most powerful time in any lunar cycle in order to manifest our reality. The more energy we put into it, the more energy the universe responds by law of attraction. So, let's zoom in. We've got a party going on in Libra, if you haven't noticed. The moon has moved into Libra. We've got Venus, we've got Mercury, and of course we've got the sun. This is a magnificent pulse of gravity, folks. In these 12 zodiac races, I'm going to outline for you how to light cast, what to focus on, and how by using that as a focal point, you can get everything you want through that one focal point. Now, it all happens because the sun, our awareness, is our intention center, right? I'm aware that I want this. The moon is our emotion, our soul in motion. Put those together, put your heart into it, fill your heart with love, which is Venus, Mercury, focus exactly on you, what you want. I mean, the universe is setting you up for nothing but success here, and I'll be helping you in each of the 12 zodiac races to focus, to teach you how to light cast, and to stand back and watch reality happen. But before you click on your horoscope, let's take a look at the moods of each of our brothers and sisters and what they're light casting this weekend or what the focal point is. Let's begin with our air signs. Gemini, sunny and childlike. They're like casting a new hope or dream. I mean, that, they're in a powerful position this weekend. The Libra and Sunny and Super Coolio, they're actually manifesting a new personality or persona. And the Aquas are cloudy and spaced out. They're manifesting a new vision or belief about how life is, period. So that's powerful as well. Now on to our fire signs. Aries, sunny and sentimental. They're like casting a new chance of love or companionship. Go Aries. The Leo, sunny and wicked shop. They're like casting a new attitude on life in general. And the Sagittarius are sunny and social. They're like casting a new place in society or a new circle of friends or all of the above. Now on to our earth signs. Taurus, sunny and hyper aware, like casting a new sense of the now, which is lifestyle, which is reality duality, right? The Virgos, sunny and valuable, they're like casting new confidence and self esteem. Go, Virgos. And the Capricorns are sunny and professional, like casting a new legacy or career path or opportunity. Now, and lastly, our water signs. Cancer, sunny and super homebody this weekend, they're like casting a new plan for family and or survival. The Scorpios, Overcast and very private. We won't see those out this weekend, I don't think, the Scorpios. But they're like casting a new faith in themselves and the universe. And the Pisces are cloudy and pensive, like casting a new trust in life, which is based on new boundaries. All right, that's all I have for this light cast weekend. Be sure to click on your horoscope. Watch it a couple of times about how to light cast your reality. And we're out there under a really nice, cool, tranquil, balanced moon in Libra. I'll be in the studio covering your astro.